everyone and welcome back to Liviv's Kitchen. We are making a delicious vegetable soup. As you can see, steam a protein of your choice. Uh, we are using goat meat, we're using the tribe and the cow skin. And uh, we have stockfish as well. We're gonna add stockfish to the pot just to boil the meat until it's, it's soft. So added our stockfish. Uh, we also have our chicken stock seasoning and uh, this takes the taste to another level so we use a generous amount of that um, seasoning um, chicken seasoning stock and then stay thoroughly and and also we blended the peppers and the onion garlic just a little bit of garlic and ginger I'm talking about two cloves of garlic and just a little piece of ginger because we don't want to overpower the soup with garlic uh, just to um, boil that meat and then some mixed herbs now we allow the pot to cook until all the proteins in the pot um, are tender cook for a, a while so we're talking about 45 minutes but if you have a pressure cooker I think it makes it easier now we go to our mackerel fish we're not going to use all of the mackerel fish this has already been grilled and they taste so delicious so we have to debone them because we're going to use them uh, for our vegetable soup as you can see we have our bell peppers there blended we have palm oil as you can see on the screen added some palm oil to the pot uh, a generous amount again about a cup thereabouts we added our blended bell peppers so there we go adding it to the pot and also we grilled in the oven some tomatoes earlier so this was roasted in the oven rather um, and then we added that to the pot I think this soup is also called a four um, a four so uh, for Nigerians uh, I'm sure you already picked that up so but I'll, I'll just call it vegetable soup uh, we added some crayfish generous amount of crayfish to um, the pot in fact without crayfish there is no soup uh, so the crayfish tastes so so good it takes the soup uh, to another level and um, it brings out all the taste it holds everything um, together so um, there we go adding the crayfish and stirring the pot thoroughly at this point our meat is already tender before you add all of these ingredients the oil make sure you have cooked your meat and it is um, almost tender so at this point we'll allow it to cook some little bit more um, and while it's cooking we we'll try to get our spinach washed and cut as you can see they look so fresh and um, lovely and we added some hot water to it because we want to um, ensure that we cook it just lightly with that hot water and squeeze out some of the the fluid from the leaf. As you know, um, spinach or whatever leaf you use, water leaf, um, they have their own juice that comes from it. So it's always good to um, squeeze it out a little bit, wash, squeeze it out um, after pouring hot water to cut um, contr water in the pot. Otherwise, you're going to have a, a very watery soup. So there we go, adding it to the pot and some more and more um, spinach to the pot. And it's already looking so good. And the aroma was something else. Um, so as you can see, added some fish, our uh, fish that was the bone to the pot. And we're almost getting to the end. Um, right now of the soup because after adding your leaf you shouldn't leave it for that long all we need to do is for it to simmer a little bit and our soup will be ready um, allow it to cook a little bit so that it could produce its own juice and and our soup will be ready but give that a good stir and as you can see it's all still green decided to add a little bit more crayfish for taste and some palm oil if you feel like um, it's a bit dry on some sides so we did all of that and we stirred it I want to shout out to Epi and Caro uh, for supporting to cook this meal today they were fantastic um, support 
um, and everyone else. Um, and then we uh, continue. Now it's time to make the sa, what we call gari. So we added a bit of hot water um, pal, um, to um, the and added our gari, uh, what we call the eba, and stirred it thoroughly um, just to make uh, the, 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 the gari solid. So there we go, mixing and mixing. And yeah, so um, at this point, I want to use the opportunity to appreciate all our followers and everyone that is liking, commenting. We really appreciate that you are cooking with us. And um, thank you for joining. Um, and as you can see, our Eba is almost ready. It's been thoroughly stirred, but we want to make it a little bit pretty. So we roll it over um with a with a clean film um just to make it look a little bit pretty and it's time to to serve our soup and our gary or eba so we put it on the plate it looks so pretty and we dish out our soup um this was absolutely absolutely um uh, delicious um, the leaf was tender the beef and the protein in the pot and the stockfish were all tender it was so juicy now take a look at um, the finished product we're gonna see what um, um, Carol and Epi talked about the meal um, as well as my husband um, let's see what he has to say about the meal but this was absolutely delicious and it looks so so pretty yeah it's time to wine and dine so um let's listen to what they have to say thank you very much for watching don't forget to follow subscribe um to our channel thank you ready yes hello Mm. Fantastic, delicious vegetable soup, my dear. Mm. You need to come to Manchester and try this. This mm. is mm. that's very nice. Better come and try. Mm. This is sumptuous. I can't ask for anything more than this. Uh, 